I had at least one staff member come to me and said, I've been working in this field for a lot of years and I've always gotten frustrated and you know, the behaviors just kind of get to me. You know, it's, I've always just felt like it's a part of the job, but in taking this class, I now see that my clients in the past were trying to tell me something, were trying to communicate with me and I miss that, but I think I can do better now. Behavior is sometimes a language that I didn't know, but now I have a better understanding and was just really excited to come back for the next day because now it's not a hurdle that I have to get through, but it's how can my approach change this outcome and get their needs met in maybe a more positive way. When it comes to communication, communicating with others in a way that, well, first that they understand is crucial here. So for some of our clients, we have to communicate with them in a variety of different ways so they understand what we're trying to teach them. In my area in particular, we have roughly 40 individuals. And I tell people is that I need to have, be able to have 40 different conversations with those people. Everyone communicates on a different level and it doesn't matter if they're you know, nonverbal or if they're completely verbal, they can still understand what you're trying to tell them um, you know, through body language, through um, facial features, um, hand movement. Uh, there's a lot of different ways to communicate with, with individuals and anyone's able to recognize the fact that you're trying to teach them something and you're willing to help them out and, and they understand that level of communication and um, they appreciate the fact uh, that you're going to sit down and, and explain something with them and not get frustrated and to be patient because ultimately what we want is for them to have um, opportunities to succeed.